How's it gaming guys? I'm Phil the Blanks and welcome to Let's Play Shovel Knight. Oh, uh, finally doing Shovel Knight. Finally, after all this time, let's start game. We are just doing the um, Shovel of Hope. I guess I started a bunch of games. Let's start a new game. Oh, let's go back to the starting menu. I'm doing great. This is a great start. Good job. Um, can I just... Yeah, can I just destroy the profile now, whatever? Oh, there's the, there's the, the garbage can. Delete mode. Delete it all! I'm actually playing this on a new, fresh kind of version of the game, I guess. I'm playing this on the Wii U, uh, of all things. I do have it for PS4, but the PS4 is upstairs. It's what we use for Netflix and stuff, so I'm not going to be like, Let's drag the PS4 downstairs so I can do some some gaming, honey. And she's like, no. <laughs> all right, doing Shovel of Hope. Dig your way through the main storyline. There are basically four storylines to this. We're just doing Shovel of Hope this time. This time, anyways. Shovel of Hope. My name! You guys all know my name. It's Phil in the Blanks. I don't know how to rhyme. I don't know why that felt like a rap for a second. I don't know why. Will Phil the Blanks fit in there? No, it won't. So let's just fill. Done. Uh, and just body swap mode. Free game, would you like to swap the bodies of any characters in the main cast? No, I'm good. It's a cool idea, um, and I, <laughs> I wouldn't mind playing the game as all girls, but then I'd have to do the girl voices, and I ain't doing that. So there we go. Phil. All right, let's do this. I oh, love this game so much. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet wrought a terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed, and Shield Knight was gone. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress, and her order of no quarter. Now, the tower is unsealed, and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Yay! Ah, <laughs> oh, Shovel Knight. This was like this crazy... It's shoveling time. I love it. It was this huge like media darling, indie darling on Kickstarter. Uh, and it's so good. It's... Oh my gosh. I could really go on and on about how much I love this. And we will. That's why we're playing it. So yay. Um, it's pretty much like a combination, weirdly enough, of like Mega Man with some Zelda 2 and some DuckTales. Uh, all of which I play on the channel, so combine them all together and you get Shovel Knight! <laughs> the greatest hero of all! Uh, so yeah, you are Shovel Knight. You little shovel, you can dig up enemies, and uh, by holding down you can do the pogo stick from, uh, from uh, DuckTales, which is really cool. Boink! Like that. This music, by the way, I... I apologize that you have to listen to me talk because I'm such a talkative guy because this music is so good. Jay Kaufman did the soundtrack to this game. He also worked on games like uh, Shantae, he did Contra 4, uh, he also did Hubert for Game Boy Color! His greatest work! No, I'm joking, but this, this is just an amazing soundtrack. This is one of my absolute favorite soundtracks in video gaming. I love it. These are um, save points, checkpoints, but if you are really confident in yourself, you can actually destroy them. Oh, you know, I guess you can only destroy them before you hit them. Ah, damn. But if you destroy them before you hit them, then you can actually, um, you, you forego the checkpoint aspect, but you get a bunch of gold. This is the opening level, uh, so I do not need checkpoints, despite the fact that I just use one. Ah, dang. Uh, so I'll destroy them when I can. There's some levels that I feel confident, there's some levels where I don't. I'm just careful there. It's been a few years since I've played this, actually, so I might be a bit rusty. But it is not an overtly difficult game. It's actually pretty easy. Hello, dragon. You're so cute. You bunk in your head. You just bunk in your head. You just bunk in your head. I get a bunk in your head. Look at the bunk on the head. I'm almost dead yet. There. There you go. <laughs> it's very old school 8-bit. It's um, it's what a lot of people think of 8-bit uh, through the rogue color, color glasses that they might have. Um, I've play, been playing 8-bit games since you know I was a kid, and I still do. I never really took a break. So my memories of 8-bit games are usually pretty accurate. But working at a game store and talking to other gamers and stuff, their kind of view on old school games is very different from mine. I think they remember just the good parts. Uh, and Shovel Knight is kind of all the good parts 
of these games and not any of the bad parts. So uh, it's it's kind of it's a modern 8-bit game. Um, this is also not what 8-bit games really look like. This is way more powerful than what the NES could do. And the music is technically stronger than, or like, not stronger, but more complicated than the NES can pull off. I think the Famicom, uh, with its, like, extra power, extra sound uh, channels can pull this off, but the actual NES that we got in North America here could not handle this. Kill guys. You die. When you see uh, these things, you can go through. Whee! Find some secrets. There are a lot of secrets in this game. Will I found them all? Will I find them all? Probably not. Uh, again, it's been a long time since I played this, and I'm playing this like just through memory. I have I have no notes or anything like that. I'm just playing it for fun. We got a music thing though. What will we do with that? No one knows except Corpo. I do know. <laughs> like I said, we're playing this on the Wii U. And it's kind of a shame. Like I, I want to play this on the PS4, and I could get upstairs and drag all the stuff, but I just didn't want to. Uh, there are some wee, um, kind of guest fights that are only available on the PS4, the Xbox One version. Uh, it's not on the Wii U version, uh, which is kind of a shame, but who knows, maybe I'll, I'll go and drag out the PS4 just for that one fight. I do not own this game on the Xbox, so we, we won't be able to see that fight. But whatever. Fun anyways. Uh, this was the first Kickstarter I think I ever participated in, and I'm really glad I did, because it's, it's probably the best thing I've ever helped with Kickstarter. Um, and I've helped start a few things. Um, oh, I wasn't sure if I was going to make that. Um, but yeah, this, this game just... Oh my god, phenomenal. Phenomenal game. It's kind of funny because nowadays we were like... It was this, again, huge meaty darling. Ah, damn it! Uh, for a while, but for for a couple of, like years, everyone was like, eh, I think Shovel Knight's kind of overrated. I think it's more of... It's it's just... It's been going on for so long. Like, the second game for this game, this franchise, whatever, still has not happened. Uh, which is Shovel Knight Dig, I think. Um, there is Shovel Knight Showdown, which is a game attached to this game. But, I mean, they had so many Kickstarter things to do that they added onto this game that it just became this giant thing. So I can't really blame them for just taking so long with this and kind of milking it in that sense. Because I, I wouldn't even call it milking it in the proper sense. So, yeah. Whatever. Eh, what? eh. Money is fairly important in this game. When you die, there are no lives. Um, when you die, I think you lose half of your gold. Um, and it's Dark Style. Uh, dark, dark Style. Dark Soul style, so you can get your money back by getting to that area. So hopefully we won't die very often. We'll die probably once or twice. It's not an easy game, but you know. Ah, hello. Hey. Is anyone over here? No. Keep searching around. You never know when you might find some fun things. Hooray. Oh, like there, for example. Papa. I found your secrets, and your treasures shall be mine. Carrots. Mmm. Question of the day, which favorite vegetable? I think we've done this one before in Mario Odyssey. Uh, but I just repeated a uh, Question of the Day when I did Super C last episode. I think it was last episode. Uh, we kill you this time. Uh, no! Why does it do it? Why doesn't it let me do it? I want it destroys you. That's weird. I was surprised it won't let me do that. Oh, whatever. I thought you could. Um, yeah, we've already done this question. They don't really care. It's my show. I can do what I want. Uh, favorite vegetable, man. Uh, yeah, cucumbers probably for me. Peppers are up there. Les piments or les poivres. For the French viewers out there, question of the day. La question de journée. Est-ce que tu appelles les, les piments or les poivres? Pour moi, c'est les piments. Mais... No, no. I'm sorry, I'm speaking French. Um, yeah, when I was a kid growing up, kind of French. I have I have not very good French. My French is terrible, despite being French. Um, when I was a kid, peppers were were pima. Uh, but for some reason, as I grew up, everyone else said poivre, and apparently there's just it's two words for the same thing. Um, but French viewers, yeah, your question of the day. You get a different question of the day. Um, I don't know if you should be happy about that. But, like, do you go by Pima? Poivre? I don't know. I have at least one guy who watches this from France. Uh, mind you, he's from around where I am, French Canada. Um, so, you know, he might have grew, grew up with Pima, but now it's Poivre because he's in France. I have no idea. All I know is that with French, just like with English and, like, there's British English and, you know, things like that. Um, there's, like, there's, there's France French, there's... Uh, Quebecois French. Um, I am Acadian French. Um, I'm Acadian, so there you go. And there's a slight difference to all of them, and it's really hard to... When you're trying to learn a language again, man, it's hard to kind of hear it all. And it doesn't help that some people are really, like, really gatekeepy about it. It's like, uh-uh-uh, c'est le mot. I'm like, shut up, I'm trying, man. I'm 
trying. <laughs> like, I'm not smart. It's hard to learn a different language. Are we there? I think we're near the end. We're near the end here. Can I kill you this time? Why? I wonder why. Oh, well, whatever. Hello. Oh my god. I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The Cerulean coward. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Stand aside, Black Knight. I've no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses. Can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress, and her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the Tower. But none of that matters, because anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel! <laughs> no! What is the history between Shovel Knight and the Black Knight? Doesn't matter, I'm just gonna bounce on him. Uh, Black Knight's very easy, as you can see. I tend to go for the bouncies instead of the stabbies! Um, just because it's safer. But you can you can stabbies his his um super cool moves. My my very cool uh terminology is awesome. Careful. Haha! -ha! That'll teach him. But yeah, the fights are very Mega Man. Uh, they're one on one. They're super good too. As you can see, they're very. But no, I almost had a perfect, perfect. You prick! I killed. Oh well, now it doesn't matter. One more. Ha ta! Pew 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 pew. And stab your butt. I hear fire. Feet accomplished. Oh, feet accomplished alive. Yeah, there are achievements and stuff if you're playing this on any other thing but the Wii U. But there we go. Huzzah! Goodbye, Black Knight. I love that background. Very cool. So that's the kind of Mega Man influence, but there is other things too. Ah, oh, we get this after every level. Shovel Knight's just like, ah, oh, warm fire for my toasty toes. Just falls asleep. What does Shovel Knight dream of? And of course he dreams of his lady love, Shield Knight. Oh, I'm so dramatic for this game because it's just so good. And this, like, look at this, it's just like, catch her. Shield Knight! <laughs> I just love it. It's just so well done. Like, I feel for Shovel Knight, man. And after you wake up, what do you do? You do the right thing. You put out your campfire. That is the right thing. Only you. Only me? Only you. That's a that's a crazy responsibility, but only you can prevent forest fires. Question of the day, only who can prevent forest fires? You have selected you, referring to me. The correct answer is you. Stealing jokes from Simpsons. All right, here we go. I'm not doing Amiibo co-op. Um, and you can see this kind of world map, very Mario 3, which is very cool. And you can see those cues there. Those are your levels. And in Mega Man fashion, you can choose which order to do them. But you do have to do them in, like, stages. So these these two characters here uh, must be defeated to break out, open those locks. And there'll be more of them. So it's, it's Mega Man, but it's also kind of a little bit of Darkwing Duck, uh, where you have um, tiers of selections. But right now, we're just going to the village. Uh, in the village. Here we go. Halt! No weapons! We have enough to worry about lately without everyone swinging swords around. Oh, haha! <laughs> That's no weapon, just a shovel. You, um, you may enter then, and don't forget. <laughs> You're here forever. <laughs> uh, press up to talk to everyone. <laughs> oh, Feral's his name. Cause no trouble, warrior. No problem. He's got quite the stances, I love it. What do you say? Come back, come back, come back! I'm gonna talk to you! <laughs> Head to the juice bar for fresh squoze juice, morning, noon, or night. <laughs> Horse head. That odd fellow Chester is selling relics. I'm so tempted to buy some. You to say. I love talking to everyone. Make sure to press up to talk to people like you did just now. Aw, oh, thank you. you. Thank you, Grand Tutorial Knight. Oh, I can't go into houses. Damn. Oh, you're... <laughs> did he know your fishing rod can haul up far, far away bags and gems out of your reach? Aye, it's the truth. Our old village is overrun with the undead, Inspector Knight. We barely made it out in time. You got this guy. It's like a bard knight. <laughs> little, little loot. Hail, Traveler. I am but a simple bard, but I have a big problem. I have lost all my music sheets. My entire repertoire lays scattered across the land. If you ever find a music sheet, return it to me, and I shall reward you handsomely. Whoa! You have two music sheets. Dude, that's... <laughs> That animation, it sparks such joy in me. Magnificent, take 500 gold for each. No, yes, just do it. Wonderful, let's see here. Oh, you found the rival. Black Knight has fine musical taste. Should have studied composition, but then I suppose I'd be the one with the rival. Now that I have this music sheet, I can perform it for you anytime. 
just ask. And yeah, he's basically um, your little jukebox, uh, which is really funny. Like, oh, I love this dear girl. I remember before the Order of No Quarter, uh, when we weren't afraid to walk around like this. He would seem unafraid to walk around. Uh, let's give him his other sheep. Hail Shovel Knight, hero of music. Work in the bard. Um, oh, I give. I guess I give him both. Do I give him both? Oh, I can do the body shops now, whenever I want. That's kind of cool. Um, wait, what's this? Uh, gear. I've returned seven? Jeez. I guess I just had a bunch. I don't know how, but whatever. Uh, some knights may look down on your choice of weapon. Between us, I dig it. Haha, <laughs> thank you. What, what are you doing later? Ooh, your twin sister looks nice. <laughs> Alright, damn you. Damn you, terrible D-pad on the friggin' Wii U. I actually keep trying to talk to people. Alright, uh, let's see. Uh, pottage and poultry, mutton and meat. Your maximum health will increase if you eat. <laughs> Bring a meal ticket, a whip of a feast. Gotitian might have some. Now where's that sly beast? Well, he's right here, enjoying some paper. Ah, decisions, decisions. Should I extend my magic or health? Or just eat a tin can? Why not buy my meal ticket and help narrow my options? Yeah, okay. A uh, thousand. I have six thousand gold, so why not, right? Yep. First purchase. Yay! Can I buy another one? Ah, uh, decisions. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, oh, they get, they get more expensive, which makes sense. Might as well go to a gastronomer, uh, and, uh, I'll dazzle your palate in no time or less, so bon appetit and pardon the mess. That flows really well off the tongue, though. Those, those rubs are great. Thank you. Point. Oh, do I have to... Oh, 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 okay. There we go. Hmm. So I've got five lives. Thank you very much. And I guess I could, uh, increase my magic. She's adorable! God, I love these people. Uh, what more use of your, uh, your relics? Oh, yes, of course. Uh, I can increase your maximum magic. Good. Oh, but no relics yet? Well, I can't. You have to find some relics. That makes sense. Chester down the ladder, he always has the weirdest things. Wait, what was I doing? Hmm. Yeah, let's head down there. We have no relics. Relics are the Castlevania part of this game. Uh, your sub-weapons, basically. Hello, four people. And over here, we have... People? Jeez, there's a lot of people. <laughs> this is Chester, I think? Yeah. Psst. Hey, blue guy. You wouldn't believe the merchandise I've got for you today. Why not have a look? Sure. Uh, we get the fishing thing and the chaos sphere. In order to boundless combat potential. Let's, um, get them both. Thank you. Uh, hold on. I don't want to get Give it a good throw. Okay. Oh, that's a really good one. I remember using that one a lot. Uh, and let's get the fishing rod. Why not? Oh, it actually, that actually takes magic. I didn't know that. Poink. Let's talk to you, you weird person. Trouple, 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 trouple. Acolyte. Uh, hello, fish friend. All hail the Trouple King. By who and hail? The king of fruit and fish. Long may his stem grow. Uh, can I buy some from him? Oh, right. I need the ch- I don't have enough money for a chalice. Oh, that's okay. We're gonna be doing a lot of things, so don't worry about it. Uh, hey, Shovel Knight. I know things are tough, but don't throw in the towel. The trowel. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> uh, Alright, we got some weirdos over here. Uh, ah, new face. Dancers, acolytes, witches, goats. Everyone's welcome in here. Thank you. Uh, ooh, that's Spectre Knight. If someone could defeat him, I would bestow upon them my greatest treasure. Well, remember that. Spectre Knight, huh? Oh, woe is me, the king of nothing, not to rule but my lone bar stool. King Knight sits on Pridemore's throne. The glided goon, he'll get his soon. Okay, Knight, King Knight. Uh, double trouble, soil, and shovel. shovel. My third eye knows your useless infos. Thank you. Excav excavatio. The number of dig piles you've dug is seven. Aurum Infiniosa. The amount of gold you collect is... Oh, this is great. Just stats. I love it. Uh, Thanato Refutatum. The number of times you've fallen in battle is zero. Temporum Perpetua. The total time you've spent adventuring is 16 minutes and 54 seconds. I magically see all of your acts. Come back again for more useful facts. Thanks for helping me, kindly witch. I'm not a witch! <laughs> oh, that's so ridiculous. And... Oh, she's important to one of the other storylines. Uh, I suppose peaceful solitude is too much to ask for. Well, as long as I'm stranded here. Shall we pass the time with a little game? I'll just need 100 gold. Ah, oh, you wanna. Alright, I'll conjure up some things, and you can hit them toward the targets for points, okay? Alright. Why not? Yeah. Yay! 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 Aww. Eh. Damn it. I'm not very good at this, am I? There we go. Ten! Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, I'm amazing at this, actually. No, nope, that was... Oh, that's still not bad. It's a pretty fun game. I don't remember this, like, at all. That's good. It means I'm getting new things that I haven't seen before. Oh, God. It's getting a little crazier in here. Up in here, up in here. I don't know if I need a certain amount of points for, like, something good. I should be going the other way, actually. 
Ah, damn, I missed the big flashy one. Uh, 236. Is that good? Uh, call me impressed. Oh, nice! And, ooh, a new, um, a, a new, a new thingy. <laughs> I can't word. Um, might as well go... What did I need to do? I need to buy something from... Oh, a chalice! Let's buy a chalice. You are very happy. Oh, whoops, sorry. Uh, yes, buy a chalice. Thank you. And then if we beat the Tropical King, uh, something might happen. It might happen. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Yay! Awesome. Yeah, check the walls for little weird indentations. That's kind of how you get stuff. Let's go give the uh, Bard, Bard Knight, some more of these. Uh, yes. Wonderful! Let's see here. Oh, you found Spin Ye Bottle. The client's only reaction was, oh, it's okay, I guess. Whatever. Sorry, was it not brooding enough for you? Now that I have this music level on. He has a little thing to say for each of them. It's a shame that you only get one at a time. It's like you want to find one song and then go find, or give it back to him. You don't want to, like, I don't know. Um, actually, let's see if we can increase our magic. Um, 1500. No, I can't right now, but that's okay. We'll find lots of magic. Or, uh, monies. Come back, you little girl. I'm gonna hit a little, little thing. <laughs> so much fun. I don't know if there's a purpose to that, but that was fun. Alright, we're gonna fit this episode up. We're, we're having a grand old time here, but we gotta keep going. Uh, yay! So happy that I dug up that thing. Wow, incredible, you really are Shovel Knight! I sure am. Uh, I'm the fastest. Don't get outrun me. All right, whatever you say, buddy. Oh, you are fancy. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, hello, my flightless friend. If you found an amiibo, I can transform into a fairy companion. Uh, no, I'm good. I've got the amiibos. I've got the shovel knight amiibos too. But whatever, it doesn't matter. So tonight, may, many trials await you. Don't despair. May each defeat strengthen my resolve. Thank you. Oh, I need to get. Where's that bouncy boo? Bouncy little girl. There you are. Come back here. No, don't go over there. Okay, yes. Let's do this. No! I need to go over here. Right. Ah. Oh, can I not jump from that? Oh. I thought that's how I'd be able to get on there. Oh, well, maybe I'll have to come back with a different type of magic. Anyways, guys, this is Shovel Knight. I am so happy we're playing this. Uh, we'll fight maybe King Knight. Maybe we'll even fight Spectre Knight. Or maybe we'll just drop on the Tropical Pond. Uh, it doesn't matter. We are having a good time. This is Shovel Knight. I'm Fellow Blanks. See you guys next level. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this episode, click that subscribe button and hit the bell icon to know when the next episode is up. If you want to support my channel, share some videos with some friends and consider supporting me on Patreon.